Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're making the scrap fabric tutu skirt. This skirt is perfect for birthday parties, costumes, playing dress up, and it's super easy to make. Here's what you'll need. You will need some tool. I have glitter tool and the plain mat tool. You'll also need an elastic band and some fabric. This is a one inch elastic band. You'll also need a mannequin or something round you can use. First, I'm taking my elastic and marking off how wide I want the waist to be. I didn't get this on camera, but I'm using my glue gun to add glue, hot glue, to one end of the elastic and placing the other end over top. The hot glue is going to be strong enough to hold the elastic band together. And you're going for a snug fit because the elastic is going to give a little bit as you add the fabric and the tool. Now I'm going to cut my fabric. This is a great way to use up scrap fabric. I happen to have this left over. Um, I bought it on the bolt so it is folded in half so you can see there. I cut each piece for my skirt 21 inches long so that'll give me about a 10 inch skirt. And these monster high strips are three inch wide. So now I have two 21 by three inch strips. So I'm going to continue cutting all of this monster high fabric. And for the pink and the navy fabric, I cut it 2 inches by 21 inches, so I made it a little thinner. So now I have all my pieces cut out, and I could just leave the end square like that, but I decided that I wanted to cut them on an angle. Now I'm going through and cutting all of the strips that way. Now I'm going to cut the tool that is not sparkly, the matte tool. So I'm just cutting the tool the way I cut tool in all of my tutorials. And here are the supplies and I actually cut way too much fabric I had quite a bit left so it doesn't take a lot of fabric to make a skirt like this so first starting at my seam where I glued the elastic together I'm gonna work on covering that first and I just apply the fabric the same way I apply tool in all of my tutorials so if you haven't seen my other tutorials check those out but I use the same technique and you just have to play with the fabric for a little while to get it to cover that seam. This part is super easy to do. You could even have your little girl help you with this. And I'm just mixing the tool and the different color fabric just randomly. Now, if you're adding tool to the skirt, you will not put this in the washing machine because, well, you could, I don't know, don't don't put it in the washing machine, <laughs> don't put tool in the washing machine, and definitely don't put it in the dryer. So I would definitely recommend hand washing this skirt and air drying this skirt. So I'm just alternating the tool and the fabric until the entire band is complete. So now that that's complete, I'm just fluffing it out, making sure I didn't miss any spaces. 
So now I'm going to add glitter tool. I don't like to add glitter tool in big chunks because if you've ever worked with a glitter tool, you'll know it's kind of stiff and it doesn't bend very well and when you try to make it bend like other tool you just end up getting glitter all over everything so what I like to do is cut it into strips and use smaller strips so here you'll see I'm cutting it into three small strips and I'm just going to add those in And so the glitter, the small glitter strips just added a pop of color and sparkle. So here's the finished look. And again, that's so super easy to make. So thank you so much for watching and subscribe for weekly videos. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.